Um, anytime fans host the tournament, uh, they want to win. Where's that coming from? The, you were part of that 98 winning team. And before that, uh, you made your move to Chelsea. After that, you made your move to Chelsea. We saw, I mean, the French team win the World Cup. And the Women's World Cup is going at a rate where you're already scared about the French crowd. Yeah, it will be top to see the ladies to make it also. They are not favorite, honestly. Oh, yeah. They are not favorite. But if they, they gather all, you know, the love and the support that they have, you know, from the from the supporters, yes. you know, it is huge. Uh, if they are able to to take the pressure yeah. and bring it into performance, yeah. then your level, you know, on the field it goes higher. That's right. That's why you are able to perform. But mm. sometimes that sort of pressure that is coming lock you up yes. and you cannot perform anymore and you lose all your ability and your skills this is what happened to us in 2002 okay. we were world cup winner european cup uh, winners. winners and we had the 2002 world cup, world cup. first match against senegal. senegal we were stuck mm -hmm. you know second game also we couldn't really because we were already world champion Champions. european yeah, champion, champion but the pressure was too much yeah. and we did not deliver Mm. So mm. these are sometimes the, the challenges. You have to be careful yes. about. Yes, you, you know, have to be careful. Uh, you, you have you have some of your this is some of your playmates, you know, handling teams. Mm -hmm. Looking forward to the Africa Cup of Nations. It's such a delight to know you know Sidoff is in charge of Cameroon. Yes. Uh, heavy Renault, of course, with French. Clivet also. Clivet, Clivet uh, also is part of it. Don't forget. I mean, tell me, how do you feel when you see your mates do that? Yeah, they have that uh, legitimate, uh, you know, um, position to yes. be as a coach. Remember, yes, they've been good soccer player, but yes. to be a good coach, you need to kill the player that you were before. Okay. Because you need to build up your philosophy. And your philosophy is not based anymore on the soccer player experience yes. that you had. It's based on uh, managerial. Uh, knowledge uh, of managerial uh, attitude, attitude and yes. experience yes. and uh, the fitness, the psychological part, yes. uh, all elements, how to deal with people. This is what it's about. So. I'm happy to see them into the system. I, I see Zidane, yeah. I see uh, many more. <laughs> many so, more, yeah. um, and bad luck for, for Thierry Henry. Yes. Uh, he knew that uh, <laughs> it was going to be difficult. difficult. But no, globally, yeah, I'm happy to see faces, famous faces. Hervé Renard, you said yes. it. I played with him uh, when we were on the 17 in national oh, yes, team. Yes, he yes. did not make it really correctly as a soccer player, soccer player. Uh, but he made it as a coach That's afterwards, a coach. yes. Yes, and he's winning stuff. But does, it, does that put any pressure on you? I mean, uh, to want to get into the field and do a lot, because I know you do a lot of football already. Yes. And you, are, you are living football your life here. But how about coaching? Does it? I finished my career yeah. and I had to decide what to do. Okay. And I really wanted to do something where I was going to be useful for the community okay. for a long term. Okay. You see? So I decided to be uh, in the media yes. to expose my sport, my football, yeah. Uh, yeah. you know, passion. Yeah. Uh, I've also in you know, uh, invested into uh, sports Sport. infrastructure. Okay. Lizzy Sports Complex is one, one here in yes. Ghana. I have other things, other places yes. also. So I wanted also to, to do a lot of charity. I've been ambassador of, uh, you know, UNICEF, UNESCO, Orphanage, okay, yes. uh, Dynamic. Yeah. So I was feeling that being part of this was much more better than being a coach, a coach. only. But I've done anyway my coaching badges and if really the opportunity comes at the right time, then I'll, I'll get back into the, the system. So see? what's the opportunity? Because I'm sure a number of Ghanaians would like you to do that. If... Yes, but it's not <laughs> actually the matter. Uh, what is good is that uh, uh, if you think about me, uh, Desai Marcel, yeah. uh, you have to think that yes, he's somebody that has been committed for the community, the community. and he has promote football yes. as much as he could yeah. through UEFA, through FIFA, through the media, through the individual sponsors that use my image to diffuse and sell their products. Yes. So this is what is important for it's me. It's There's it's a whole lot. A whole lot. So coach, so suddenly coach you is, want to bring me into, I'm locked and, 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 and it's finished. Okay. Uh, so, so, so you know it's going to take some time. Okay, that's fine. That's yeah. fine. <laughs> I, have, I have something that, yes, yes. I have to share with yes, you. I have the fear of today you are coach, they love you. Okay. Tomorrow it doesn't it work. It doesn't work well, the results. They hate you. Hmm. This is something so that I all the time you don't fear. Like that. Okay. Yes. Because I know that if I go into something, I will give 150%. Yeah. And if it doesn't work, 
I'm not sure I can recover. Mm. It's also one of the issue I have for not being into the system of coaching. That's right. Excellent. Okay. Let's talk about the Africa Cup of Nations and quickly we're looking forward to it. I mean, I just want to pick up what your expectations are generally, knowing that the video assistant technology is going to be used from the knockout stages. So it's good. CAF, Africa, Yes. trying technology. Are we going to be at the level? What expertise do we have, you know, in front of the screen, the screen especially to be what's able to... in the CAF Champions League final, yeah. that, that whole debacle between Esperance and Badal? Have, have they been able to identify people who really have that expertise to be able to, to have that quick, you know, uh, decision um, to, to help the game to be faster and more fair? Because at the end, this is what Jani uh, wanted, the game to be more fair you know because it was not normal when it's clear offside the main referee did not see it everybody it's saw it in the, in the stadium and it still go on yes. go the team lose the we have an example uh, 2010 mm -hmm. uh, germany england england yeah you remember lampard, yeah i remember that. Lampard, lampard pam pam, pam, pam. it's <laughs> in easy nobody yeah, see it yeah, you see? Yeah. could have made a difference and 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 the, and the english will remind you or the germans will remind you of what happened in 66 Wow, oh, 66. <laughs> wow, you have the records. Wow, this is... Uh, that was another one. I actually saw the German it's Museum when I went. I was that's... not born. Yeah, I know. I was not born. I was watching. That's fine. That's fine. So let's talk about um, the, the Black Stars. They, they're going. They're, hope, they're hoping that they can break this once and for all. What, what do you think? They don't hope that? anything because you are not one of the favorites. There is four, <laughs> five teams before you. Yeah. I mean, Morocco, Egypt, Senegal. Uh, Cameroon, Senegal, Senegal. who are... Yeah potentially better than you yeah. but it's good mm. the pressure is not on you mm. you can work very strongly i said the preparation is key yes. to be able to to prepare um, physically the whole group and especially tactically mm. you know as i said ghana doesn't have the individual player that can make the difference at any time okay you know so collectively they have to play. Mm. They have to find the correct tactical setup to be able to perform and to have that consistency in the performance. That's right. You know, throughout the tournament. That's right. You see, Zambia won it without being uh, excellent. Yes. Uh, many others. Mm. <laughs> Ivory Coast, no, is not a good example no, no good because example. they had yeah, plenty Nigeria, top players. Nigeria had, Nigeria had uh, barely top, new players. Top so players, can... yes. So we have good players, yes. yes. Mm. Good. Uh, Andre and well, yeah, yes. and Thomas others. Pate and the like. They are. But um, not to be able to pretend on, yes, we are going to AFCON, show about ourselves, and, and, and at least we make it to the semi final and uh, we, 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 are, we are supposed to win it. Yes. It's not like that for Ghana. Not okay, so Mr. just before we, um, we end, what would be your advice um, to Coach Kwesi Apia, who's watching, and the players? No advice. He knows already. He knows that tactically he has to find the, the best setup for his team to be able to, or for his team, for each individual players to express themselves at their best. Mm. This is key for them. It's key that he understand and he read and he, he give them a project, match after match, uh, not giving them for, uh, uh, false hope or, mm. or whatever. Anything. So yes, the tactical setup is quite important. Yeah, how he's going to, to find the skills and the ability for, for his players. Yeah, key. Mm -hmm. On top of the preparation, I said it yeah, before, yeah, yeah. it's key. Either he prepare his players to be sharp from the beginning, or he believes that, yes, no need for them to be sharp from the start. Relax. Let them work. I believe on them for passing the first round and I make them ready for the second round, uh, you know, um, for them to now come and perform and make the difference with a good tactical uh, set up. This is again uh, key. Well, that's about it. Uh, but just thinking, just a final question. Look, if you had to show or say who's winning this Afcon? Egypt? Egypt. Ghana? Choose one. Egypt. Thank you. Thank you very much for your time. I'll say. <laughs>